Right, I have put down my empty chest in favour of this one, which is my goody chest. Now, I have set my spawn here and I am going to go back to the artisan trader. I have set down a teleporter to the artisan trader through here. Oh, and here we are on a beautiful, beautiful day. Now let's put our treasure chest down. Right. Let's see what he or she will take. All right, got anything to trade? Now you will take a rough peridot. What quality will you take? Medium, low. Sell. Nice. Do you have a low diamond? You do. Lovely. What about a low emerald? High, low. Right, so we now got medium, high, high, high. All right, that's about all we can do, but that has left us with 35 rusty gears. Oh, wow. And you will take peat. Now, so 35 rusty gears. We've got seraphim, salvation, we have ambush, nightfall, morning, ambush, morning. So we've got two morning and two ambush. There are five, nine, right. That is ambush center third ambush left third morning center third morning right third okay total cost 24 gears bye that sounded painful for you mate okay we've got 11 gears left Ooh. Bye. Wow. We've done well there. Thank you, my friend. Right, let's pop our trading stuff back in our trading chest. Let's pop it on our back and head home and decide what to do with our goodies. Right, it's dark in there. We'll have all sorts of things spawning. What is the temperature now? Minus one, it's better, it was minus 15 at one point. All right, now we've got tapestries that we can put on the wall. This needs sorting out here. Right, so they need, they are three wide. So we have left third of ambush, center third of ambush. Nice, and then we've got the center third of that one and the right third okay so we have that and that perfect so we just need a little bit of those two and then we have this absolutely beautiful 
storage vessel. That is not going to look good here, but we know where it will look good. And we know it will look good in this area. We know it's going to look great over here in what will be our cellar up here. Perfect colouring for here. Lovely. 1.5 years. Yeah, this is all doing very well up here. It's so cold. We are really in the frozen north here. I've taken so much stuff back with me. I want to take the cornflowers back there. Right. Oh, it's looking better here. What is the temperature? Wow, we've got as high as zero. Spelt. Flax. Oh my goodness. Everything. Everything. Yep, this will be our summer palace. But in the meantime, let's keep going we've still got enough food to keep going a lot longer so we are out here in this desert and we are sorting out what traders we've got now we've got one up here so we're going a little bit away from this one. Oh wow Right, so we want to go up. Yeah, basically around the north end of this lake. Let's do that. Let's eat as we go. And this should be shale, yeah. That reminds me, that is the artisan trader, and we want you to be aquamarine. Absolutely. Now we will travel on in the glooming dusk. Oh, nice. ruins. I'm not sure we do need more shale cobblestone but if we do we know where to come. Oh wow. Wow. So many shells. Did I pick those all up? I did. How is my body temperature doing? We're okay. We are oops, warmly wrapped up in our furs. Wow, that was nice to find. All right, keep going around the edges. A little bit inland, perhaps. Ah. So much flax to pick up. Oh my. This is rye. Yeah, we're in a nice cool climate here. Flax and masses of copper. So we're going into the fertile lands up there, into the warm fertile lands we hope. Oop. Goodness me. Let's come up here a little bit, 
go around the edges it's a bit of a dodgy terrain Wow Yeah, I need to go slightly more this way. I can hear a riff too. It might just be the wind. Okay. Tell it's cold, we've got fish. Okay, I'm now cold and wet. But there's no hope for this area. Right. Goodness me. Let's give ourselves a bit of light. That is better. How am I doing? Soaking wet, yes. Let's hope we can dry out a bit. I would have been better in these northern climes to stay out of the water. Okay. We are on some sort of upland coming into the bauxite area. Do you remember we saw that on the map? Oh. That we had bauxite. Nice. And I think I'm going in the wrong direction here. I need to go directly in that direction. Here we are. Oh, jungle. Wow. That looks like the trader over there. This isn't the same trader we've been to, is it? I'm just looking out for holes in the ground, that's why I'm going a bit slowly. Let's carry on up here. Shale still. Yeah, that looks like there's a trader over there. I can tell by the light and the map. So what are you, Mr. Trader? What are you? Apart from a welcome light in the darkness. Oh, you're a big, big trader. That's a lot of trader. Oh. Oh no, you're blocked. Are you blocked? No. Wow. Ugh. Got anything to trade? You're an agricultural trader. Oh, but you would like aged crates, and we have some of those. Do you have a bed? You do. Right, let's get you marked as an agri trader. Uh, no. Trader, agri. So we know what you are. And we've got bauxite in this region as well. Now there's another trader up here. I think what we might do is sleep in your bed and see you in the morning. Well, good morning. I've woken up. It's pitch black. And as I had taken a few days without recording anything, I had completely forgotten what I was doing. Um, this agriculture trader, I have so many agriculture traders. There seems to be a preponderance of them. I want to go to this one next. Um, so as soon as it's light, and what time is it? five o'clock in the morning. What's my temperature like? My temperature is okay. Um, I have 
plenty of food. That's only fresh for eight hours. And the other one is fresh for one day. Okay, let's eat that one. I mean, we do have food as well, so we're not, we are not starving. Ah, there were three of those sundials, I wondered. All right. I am tempted to start out. I would like to mark this as jungle, this area though. Um, let's just mark it as jungle and bamboo so that we know it's there. Let's mark it as green. Will that show up? Hope for the best. Yes, it does. Jungle and bamboo. And there's probably not much doubt about it, but we're now going to travel up to here. We're doing a very wide circle to try to pick up all our things. Right, so this is one of the most awkward traders. So we are going to go up in this direction. I've got my light on. It is just getting light. Oh my goodness. I've got Rafflesia down there. That's quite a... Oh, crikey. Oh my gosh. Oh dear. Yeah, I do want to take that. Let's take some of these while we're going. Yeah, make sure we're picking everything up. And I also happen to want a couple of these. I don't want to take them, the papyrus from near me because it's too pretty. And this is papyrus, yes. Just making sure I've got the right thing. Yeah. Yeah, I also want to take some of these. I mean, I am, as you can see, getting myself thoroughly wet again. And we'll take the Rafflesia. <laughs> oh, goodness me. Right, now, we need to go up that way. It is getting dawn. All right, let's try not to fall in this hole again. Right, so we, there's, I'm going back the way I came. So given a choice of two directions, I will always take the wrong one. Yeah, that's where we fell in. Can we go around the edge here? To cut our way through the forest. I feel I need a machete, not a knife. Oh, wow. Oh my goodness. Uh, we are high up. More Rafflesia. Yeah? Looking for pineapple. I can't see it. So let's not go down there if we can help it. Can we get down at all here? That's not the same hole, is it? Probably. Let's come over here. Yeah. There we go. This is pretty. Pick that one up. Uh, we are getting into a bamboo forest. Right. Gosh, I can't see a thing. I do want some of these vines. So I'm very happy to have those. Wow. Are we still going in the right direction? I think we are. Nice. Wow, set out with the dawn. What is that? Forest floor. I am looking, of course, very carefully to see if I could see any 
high fertility soil. That would be my ideal. What have I got on me? Oh my goodness. All sorts of things. Right, let's get some berries inside us. Now. Yeah, I'm actually heading in the right direction. These rocks look amazing. They look sort of like half-formed buildings, don't they? They're so very square. Right, let's not fall into any holes again. Oh, wow. Now we are on shale. Very nice. We want to go up there. Let's go around this edge here. Is this by any chance rice? That would be very useful. Nice. Rice is fantastic for hot climates. Good. Four rice. I like it. And let's put that on our bar. We can munch our way through it. more rice just having a quick look at the hillsides to make sure that I'm not missing any soil there's more plants over there let's eat our way through this rice now what have we got over here Spelt. Good. Oh, golden poppy. Have I got golden poppy? I do not know. I know I've got the orange plant that grows in the deserts, but this is a different plant to this. Let's take some while we're here. I know I meant to be catching up with that trader. Now let's have a quick look. Yay! Oh yes. Um, right, now. Let's pop that down. And that down. Let's get um, this off here. I think what I've got with me is my trading basket. But that doesn't matter. can't get any more in there. It still gives me some inventory space. Let's move that to there. Right. Now what can we move off our bar? And this can be eaten. We can free up a space that way. And we've got some high fertility soil. This is exactly what I was hoping I might find in these more verdant areas. Wonderful. Great. Wow. There's quite a lot of it. This will help our farms no end. Any more? Medium, medium. Let's look from here. No. Okay, let's have a quick look 
medium. All right. Good. How many did we get? 37. That's a win. And we are now heading back up towards the trader, I hope. More spelt. Oh, beautiful gazelles. Oh, that's so pretty, isn't it? So pretty. The spelt will last 90 days. Wow. Oh, it's lovely, this game. Right, now we need to come round here and get out of the water a little bit and we need to head back up this way I think let me just check yeah we're pretty well on target for the trader up here I would love to actually get pictures of these gazelles but they run so fast that you're just sort of you know watching the backside of a gazelle vanishing into the distance as you can see over there right and that's a beautiful tree. That's walnut, I think. Yeah. We've got carrot. Should we take it? Why not? Oh, we are in a cedar-rich area. Or maybe it's just this time of year makes it cedar rich. Yeah, it's such a sparse area that, you know, any seed shows up so brightly. Let's come up to the top here and have a look. Ooh. Wow. So the trader. Ah, oh, it's quite close. And we've got surface quartz, always nice. Lovely, that's a good one to have. So we've got surface quartz. Yeah. And that looks like peridotite. It's another good one to have. Oh, I'd love to take all these lupins back with me. I really would. Isn't that pretty? Let's come back this way. Oh! Oh, do you see what I see? And I do not have my shears with me. I have an axe. Uh, let me get... I wonder. Let's just mark this copper. Would I be able to get any seeds from this if I use my axe? And that is brown coal. Wonderful. Great. Um, this is a great area. Good. Right, back to what we're doing. I tell you what, copper and brown coal. Right, let's... If I use an axe... Did I get a seed? I did. Fantastic. 
I can hear goats. Oh my word. Did you see that? Carrots again. We can take all those. I want to be able to kill one of those. Goat hunting. Uh, piece of flax I can't get to there. Let's not die in a ditch over that. Amaranth. This is a rich, rich area. And I want to mark that I've got this brown and white goat. I don't even know what it's called. The trader is near here. Where is the trader? This is a beautiful area. I want to come back here, but I want to find this trader. Where's the trader? I mean, I'm going in circles. I have never ever not found a trader before. Where? I'll tell you what. Let me delete that. That's because it wasn't a trader. Oh my gosh. I've come all this way for a non-existent trader. <laughs> that just shows I'm not always right when I read the map. Okay, can I see another trader on this area? I cannot. But this is, a, I'm gonna mark this as the brown and white goat. I know. The brown and white goat area. How about that? <laughs> we do not have any animal signs, do we? We have bees, but we don't have goats. I think maybe we won't have that sign. I think we may will have that sign then we know it's something special. Okay, well, I am out in the middle of nowhere. Where is home? Where am I? There's another trader there. Then let's go and see that other trader. Let me make sure I'm going in the right direction. It's getting dark again. This has been a very successful mission, though. Is this where we're... No, is it heck? No. <laughs> is it that way? Yes. <laughs> Due east. Let's go towards the other trader, even though it's dark, having had a lovely time in this area and found some very interesting things. Oh, my gosh. We're in one of these areas that is really, really difficult to traverse. Hmm. In the dark, with the sun and the moon out. A total eclipse, I think. I'd like to get away from this. Ooh, there's a big cave there. Why are you going up? Why not? 
Oh gosh. Um, I'm going the wrong way. I want to get out of this. Yeah, that's medium soil. Still checking the soil fertility here. Let's come down here. Good, we're on ground, level ground. Now we need to go east this way. Let's try to go, oh, lovely, copper. That's good. I love the speed of the map when you do this. We've got bald cypress. Oh my word. Oh wow. Mmm. Wow. There's a rabbit hiding under there. I need I need to go this way. Just having a bit of trouble with the terrain at the moment. I need to go to the right. And I think I'm stopped by cliffs and a large lake. Oh, very. Oh, wow. Olivine. Nice. Um, what colour would you mark olivine? Olivine. Good. That's another useful one. You come to the point where you think just swim across and have you noticed how this is um, a bad area to be in because my temporal gear is going downhill there's some very deep lakes these days it's better Um, if in doubt, destroy the landscape. Right, let's head over. Olivine bits. We haven't got the inventory space, really. If we want olivine, we'll have to come back and collect it. Where am I going? I... I think I'm going to have to swim across this lake. I'm still heading east, that's all right. Oh! Oh, we're in a different sort of jungle now. Wonderful. Redwoods, great. Mighty redwoods. Wow, they are beautiful trees. In real life and here. All right, what's our body temperature like? We're all right, actually. Let's go and swim across. Get our furs wet. Let's do that. Through the night. Can you see my shovel coming in at the side? Looks as if I'm paddling. And this is peridotite sand, lovely. Right. Wow, this is a, a barren plain. Right. Come on, pick up the pace and don't fall in anything nasty. And by that I mean a cave. There we go. This is a really barren place. 
and we're coming to another vast lake. Oh my word. And what is that? Slate. Oh God, it's snowing. No. Oh my word. Oh gosh. Oh. How's my body temperature? Soaking wet, but okay. Wow. Through the darkness and the rain. And I think, what's that? Oh my gosh, we're on sandstone now. Good grief. Okay, let's just work out where we are. Slightly in that direction. We'll have to swim again, oh my word. Got fish. Next time I shall bring a raft. It's very beautiful though, swimming at night, isn't it? I do love swimming. I understand in the next update we might get sailing boats. Ooh. Right, let's keep going. Oh my gosh. Yay. Come on. Come on. Come on. It's an easy way of travelling. There's a lot of bald cypress around here. Just swimming through the dark. The starlit sky above, very beautiful. I have actually swum at night, but I was in Dubai on a rooftop swimming pool. It was 40 degrees and I was swimming at night with the stars above. It was fabulous, absolutely fabulous. I expect I'm getting colder and colder. Let's keep eating. Keep our body temperature up. Keep going. Come on. Oh my word. I, f I found an inland sea. That's a macro. I can hear bees as well. And the trader is up here. Is that his light or her light? Yeah. Oop, don't drown. Yeah, I can hear the trader complaining already. Oh, can we get out of the water? Oh, <gasps> yes. Okay. Hello, trader. Oh my gosh. Look at that face. A building material. Got anything to trade? Wonderful. That's terrific. And you will take age crates. Yeah. How much will you pay for them? Two gears. Not as good as the Agri Trader. Well, guys, I will see you in the next episode and we'll deal with this amazing looking trader. Bye bye.